Hey there, the very first workout that I've ever done on video. Complete! And you're gonna love it. Uh, you're gonna feel a lot better afterwards, and I guarantee it. Uh, we're gonna start with a warm up, what I call a WUP, which is a WUP. And in the way we're gonna do it is WLA, Way of the Life Athlete. Voila! That's how you say WLA, voila. Easy to do. Uh, so the word of the day for the workout is excelsior. And I'll tell you what that word means and how we're gonna apply it to the workout after the warm up. But first, 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 somebody who made a big impression on me early on was this guy. Can you believe it? He had his own record album of a follow along. And look at these, these are like resistance cores. He's still using them today. This is probably 1950. So uh, I met him uh, in San Francisco at a trade show. I'll tell you about it, but let's get going with the WAP, the warm up. It's gonna go zero and 60, meaning we're gonna start slow and we're gonna build. And we're gonna get every joint warm and ready to perform the workout coming up. Okay, first, always first, always first, breath. Three breaths. In through the nose, out through the mouth, deeper on this one. Feel your feet. Awesome. Okay, little arm slaps. We're gonna slap our bodies gently and we're gonna have a blast. So one of the keys is uh, in moving, <laughs> and one of the keys in moving is simply just to go at your own speed. As they say in baseball, which I worked for a Mariner baseball team a long time ago, uh, the baseball players would say, stay, inside, stay within yourself. So that's just do what you can do, pay attention to what your body needs, okay? We're just gonna do back and forth like this, Easy, easy. So uh, it was San Francisco, uh, 19, long time ago, decades. I met Jack Lance, stood in line like a little kid, and he was sitting on this bar stool, not at the bar. And uh, okay, let's go on, we'll slap the hands here and here behind you, if you can, don't worry, if you can't touch, don't worry, and here, boom, knuckles, palms, knuckles, palms, in this way. And so I stood in line and waited about like five people deep. He was a rep for a uh, fitness company of some sort. And, you know, I was like this little kid and, he, and I finally got there and he gave me a, uh, <laughs> a bro handshake. Okay, let's keep going. Shoulder circles, little, little, that's it, a little bit bigger. He gave me a bro handshake, looked me right in the eye. I mean, he was, you know, he was 80 something. He's very lucid, start small, go backwards. And he said, I told him I was in the same business he was. And he said, always practice what you preach and always tell the truth. <laughs> I said, well, I've done the first fairly well, the second not so well. So that was my, that was my time with Jack. So it was a great time. Wrist circles, here we go. That's make a circle. How about doing it with your palms open? There you go, that's it. All right, body's coming alive. The reason we warm up, so we perform better and we're uh, ready. It is a state of readiness. You get your body in to be able to do anything better. So this is gonna help you do your workout. We're doing flops now, little wrist flops. You know, go ahead and make it into an arm movement too, or just a wrist, like that. Go back and forth. Yeah, like that, perfect. All right, shake it out, shake it out. Think deep breath in. All right, here we go. Elbow circles here. This is a circle at the elbow joint. It's not really the elbows doing the circle. We're going to do both this way. Let's just keep the arms parallel to the ground, approximately. Do circles one way, biggest circle you can, and then go the other way. Feeling anything getting warm? <sighs> 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 
good. Shoulder flops. Ha, 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 ha. We're flopping them. Shake them loose, shake them loose. The looser musculature is, the better it performs. Okay, let's do a couple cross our bodies like this. Take one hand high, one arm, one arm low, one arm high. Whew, that's it, boom, boom. Okay, next, three-way press, three-way press. Overhead, one, two, three, four, and five. Good, out in front, one, two, three, four, and five. Gonna bend over body parallel to the ground. One, two, three, four, five. What's below five? Oh, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, all the way straight, all the way in, five. I think that was five, yeah. Four, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Guess what's next? One, two, one, two. All the way down, all the way up. One, one, one. Ah. <sighs> Hands on your hips. Here we go, hip circles. Forward, side, back, side. Where'd this come from? I'll tell you where this came from. <laughs> this came from football, warm-ups, and junior high school. Earl Warren Junior High School in the town of Solana Beach, California. Right north of San Diego. Other direction. Wherever your hips go, the upper body goes the other way. Back, forward, and back. Side and side. Back and forward. It's like that. Awesome. Good. Take a deep breath. Here we go. Take your stance outside shoulder width. Touch the ground or approximation. And arms back, chest open. One, two, three. That's it. Four. This time that we're gonna rotate to the right. Come up and rotate right, like you're throwing something over your shoulder. And then the other shoulder. Here we go. Now we're rotating. So we're flexing the back, we're extending the back. We're rotating. This is a complete warm-up, guys. It really is. A little bit old school, but you know, sometimes old school is good. Great. All right, deep breath in. Feel your feet. Okay, good. Here we go. Toe touch. We're gonna go out, for each as far as you can, then somewhere in the middle, and then between your legs. Okay, one, two, three. I'll turn this way so you can see. One, two, three, up. One, two, three, up. One, out in front, behind, at the end. One more, out in front, between your feet, and there. Awesome. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, leg up. Straighten one leg, pull the other one up. Straighten the other leg, pull the other one up. Sprint drill, sprint warm up drill. Sprinters do. Boom. Okay, we've got a tough one now, a little balance. Let's get into those feet, guys. Okay, here we go. Take this leg up over the imaginary hurdle here in front. Take it back. Up, over, around, through. Oops, use, hold on to something if you need to. Up, over, and through. That's it. Up, stand up. Lean forward. Good, that's enough. Here we go. Back, over, through. Oops, I'm going to use this wall. Have fun with it. Breathe. Don't hold your breath. Don't turn blue. That's not going to help your warming up. Good. Here we go. Shake it up. We're almost done. Okay. Hop on your toes. I want you to walk around in a circle. Toe raise. Position. Okay. Backwards. Whoop. Lost my way. That happens. I'm kind of going crab walk. <laughs> okay, on your heels now. Heels, good. Okay, walk in a circle. Walk in a circle on your heels, good. 
Good, that's it, good. Toe raises now. Up on your toes, back down, up on your toes. Let your arms be a part of the movement. Up on your toes, boom. We're gonna do one more, I'm gonna add one more in here. An oldie but goodie, okay. Put all of your weight on one leg, take the other leg, and kind of do circles on your toe, big toe. Yeah, feel that? Ankle warming up, hip warming up. And done. Take a deep breath in. Good. That's the end of the walk, the warm up. Now, this may be enough for some of you. That may be, this may be the workout. That's fine. Or maybe some days you don't need anything more than this. This is enough. And that's fine too. Just know that just because there's two pieces to this, it doesn't mean you have to do something. This is staying within yourself, as I started off saying, okay? Knowing what works for you, you're your best coach. All right, so the intention is Excelsior ever upwards. So the way to life athlete is simply a way to how, the how to, to keep moving upwards in your body, in your mind, in the spirit within you, to enjoy your life, enjoy your body, and perform better. It is the basis for my performance in the, uh, in the Olympic Games and the Olympic trials, which got me to that. So I'm sharing with you what worked for me and it worked for a lot of people over the last 40 years. Soon. Hey, here we go. You ready for the workout? Let's do it. Okay, we got uh, eight movements. We're gonna go through twice each time. A little cardio piece in between, uh, anaerobic uh, versus aerobic. And remember, this is a complete workout. You got a little bit of strength, you get a little bit of uh, power, you got a little bit of balance, you got a little bit of anaerobic, aerobic breath, uh, a little bit of agility. It's complete, all in one workout. I'll try to give you variations to make it a little bit easier. This is a medium, could be a medium hard workout, okay? We're gonna go about 30 seconds per movement and just a little bit of a break in between. All right, are you ready? Okay, one deep breath in, connect to your feet. Remember, Excelsior ah, is the word. One more time. Okay, good stuff. Here we go. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a little sumo position here. We're going to put your, I'm going to move back, I'm going to move back here a little bit. Put your hands on your knees, fairly wide stance, outside width. You're going to come up and back down. A little settle at the bottom. You sink. All the way up. Take the weight on the other side. How far you go down to make it easier? If you want to just do it up in here, that's great. All right, good enough. Standing on one leg, leg out to the side. You're going to shift. You're going to put the other weight, the weight on your inside leg, the one you're standing on, and then the inside leg. Skater's Lunge, Apollo Ono, a buddy of mine, won eight medals. And you go deeper, you make it harder. Eight medals in speed skating. Down lower, up higher, to make it easier, harder rather, sorry. Or you can stay up here. That's it, boom, boom. Weight, nose, chin on top of knee, on top of foot, boom, boom. Lean forward. Sit back, you're done. That's it. Whew. All right, here we go. All right, upper body push up time. My variation of push up, which I like a lot. Hands on the outside of shoulders, not out here, not out here, not yoga style. Outside here, roll up, roll back down. One, roll up. Don't do this. We'll get to that. Roll up, roll down. Five, here we go. Roll up, knees off. Knees, roll down. One, two, three, roll down. Breath in. Knees down, here we go. Leg out, leg out. Back down, hitting something back there. Out, out, out. Knees, back down. Again, if this is too hard, go back to the roll up, yep. Do the next one there. Push back into your shoulders. Uh, take a deep breath in. Relax. 
Relax, stay within yourself, as I said earlier. Center. All right, V position, V sit here. Arms out, easy version, hold. You can just hold this, harder version. Roll down, arms overhead, grab your legs, roll back up. Here, harder version, legs off, hold. Slowly extend legs down, bring your legs up. Harder version still, here, legs up. Extend legs, extend arms, pull back up, boom, whoa, missed it. Here, easy, medium, harder. Uh, exhale, 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 stay long and tall. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Hold, here's fine, you can stay there. Here, down, boom, up, awesome. Hips go forward, stretch out your abdominals just a little bit. Side to side, always oh, stretching, always oh, lengthening muscle, tissue and ligaments and tendons, tendons muscular mostly. After you use them, always a better way. Let's get the heart rate up now. Are you ready? Okay, like you're skiing, okay? You jump, now you don't have to jump. The easier version is go on your toes and back down like this. Okay, I'm gonna jump forward, I'm gonna jump back. Forward and back, back and forward, side and back, side and back. Turn 90 degrees, 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 one, two, three, four, five. Huh? You want to make it harder, jump higher. Jump further out to the side. Whatever you need, or don't jump. You always have variations. It does not have to be hard to be good. It's the one thing I learned, that after I learned how to push, learn how to, after I learned how to push with my mind to will things, the next level of kind of wisdom and performance and just being in your mind and body is choosing when to do that. And I found that most times it was unproductive to go that hard very frequently. So, learn, learn, learn. Wisdom, wisdom, wisdom. All right, you ready? Here we go, round two. Down low, back into the legs. Get a little bit lower if you can. Here we go, up, back down. Pull that leg like you're pulling that leg up. I like to make noise when I breathe, just to know. How many seconds is that, 20? Ha! And heart rate up, baby. Yeah, baby, here we go. Three, two, one, ha! That's about 80% for me. I can still talk, but I'm a little bit winded. That's 83%. Yeah, I don't work any harder than that. Most of the days it's 70, 60s, some days nothing. Zilch is good to do too. Okay, guess what? Another leg movement. Skaters lunge, that's been about 30 seconds. Stay breath in. The more fatigued you get, focus more on your breath. Deepen your breath. The more that you get tired. Okay, here. Nose, knee, foot, all underneath. Very little weight out here. Boom, 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 boom. You can go higher. Make it harder, I don't want to, but you can. You can just step like this. You can step high, make it easy. No problem, we're gonna go with this version. That's it. All right. Single leg, a little bit of agility. Um, no balance, really, uh, but certainly heart rate. So three components. I'm always thinking about what movements do for you. That's what I'm giving to you. All right, roll up push-ups. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna turn this way. All right, I'm gonna make it a little bit harder. Roll up. Here, roll down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, roll up, three, three push-ups from the knees, one, all the way up and down, two, touch your belly and your, and your chest together, three, good, regular, one, up, two, up, three, and go back to easier, that's fine, let's do all together, one, roll up, roll down, ah, three, here we go, down, up, leg off, down, down, up, leg off, here, down, up, leg off, last one, both legs off, <laughs> yeah, if you can do that, show it to me, send me a video, all right, how you feeling, check in, not how do you feel, everybody says fine, what do you feel, you feel tired, how hard, how hard are you working right now, are you at an eight, are you a nine, are you pushing too hard? How much energy did you have when you started? This is all stuff about knowing you. Self-coaching is about knowing yourself. High performance is about knowing how much to do. All right, are you ready? Here we go. All right, the center. The center is everything in the center of your body, but it's all connected, always, always connected. There's no such thing about one movement that's working the center, core, I don't use the word core. Here we go. V sits, lengthen spine. That sets the center of your body already. Arm out here, this is the next harder position here. You can just hold this. I'm gonna go to the harder version. Out, legs off the ground, arms overhead. Come back up, hold. One, two, three, and down. Up. That's it, the more fatigued you get, the more you focus on your breath, lengthening and deepening, exhale, boom. Here we go, up, 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 up. Lengthen, chest open, chest open, back long. Here we go, last one, hop. Good, remember you can always do something easier. Always do something easier, it's legal. I honor the fact that you can choose and that you would choose to do something easier because you paid attention and you said no, that's enough. That, my friends, is the life athlete way. All right, what do we get next? Boom, boom. Jumps. Oh, man. Oh, after the heart rate's already up. Here we go. We're gonna push this one 45 seconds. Remember, you can just do this. You can step, what I call step jumps, like this, like this, like this, like this. That's a step jump, that's easier, okay? Here we go, here we go, 45 seconds. One, two, three, use your arms. Forward, backwards, backwards, forwards. Quarter turn, quarter turn. Ha, land softly, feel your feet. Good, quarter turn, quarter turn, quarter turn. Okay, guess what? Can you go 180? Ha, ha, can you go 180 the other way? Don't worry if you can't. Boom, boom. Side, side, forward, back, forward, side, boom, boom, land softly, smile, ha, 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 boom. You did it. You did it. Breathe. Okay, I'm officially an 8.5. All right, heart rate got up, right? Let me know how you felt with this workout. It was totally uh, no equipment, obviously. Um, and how did you feel afterwards? How did you feel the next day? I wanna know how you felt. So leave that in the comment box. Uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You can do that over here. And there's a video over here too about shoulders. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, this is a big day for me, the first day that I've ever done an entire workout, um, the complete workout, the way of the life athlete, WLA, voila, there you have it. And uh, again, dedicating this to my man, Jack, inspirational and a big part of my life. And uh, thank you, Jack. And uh, I love the move as much as he did. Remember the words of Jack, always practice what you preach and always tell the truth. And if you can't, <laughs> do the best you can. 
That's all you can ask for. Okay, until next time, take good care of yourselves, please. You're the only one that can, and you will be so much better for it. All right, till next time, keep moving.